Hey, good morning, everybody. This is John Sterling. You can check me out on the next episode of The Jesse T Show, Merging Vets and Players Atlanta Coordinator. Thinking about the integrations back into society on both sides, military and, and players, and bringing those together, what are some of the common themes or common hardships uh, that they're facing immediately? Like, what, what are their, their plans when they're coming right out? And, like, how do they reintegrate back into society? And then what are they finding when they do that? And then how does MVP tie all that together with some of the things that you can kind of help them get over sure. those hurdles? First thing is you need relationships. Being vulnerable, too. You need to be vulnerable, yeah. right? And so when you put that out there, then you have people say, uh, oh, by the way, me too, me too, me yeah. too. And then what MVP does, because we're, we're in some sense, a one-trick pony. We get people in a space that allows them to do this mixed martial arts workout that sure. we facilitate to loosen them up, if you will, to yeah. get those get those endorphins flowing yeah. and, and, and get things get where they to need to be. Get back to competitive a little bit, right? get used and, to and, training. And, right, yeah. comfortable being uncomfortable. Yeah. And then we, we're, we're allowing people then to use that to, to have that trust and that relationship building morph to the next step where they tell us what they really need. Well, my job yep. is to develop those relationships that allow those things to happen. So then now they're trusting me to say, you know what? And this just happened like two days ago. First time in, a female that trusted someone else to come in, a male, um, they knew each other through some service they yep. had. No one knew it at the time, but she was homeless and she also needed a job. Wow, wow. And was able to trust the people time one in the room to communicate that, yep. and they said, "Can we talk to John That's about that? Because he's going to write." So, these are the things that you know. That was a veteran, but I also just explained before we came on air that I had a a first round draft pick athlete in the NFL call me, and life had handed him some things, and he literally was on the phone with me, telling me about this. I'm hearing this background noise. Yep. He was being evicted. At the time of the call. At the time of the wow. call. Wow. Talk about trust and talk about like no, need. I, and I, I came back to the group. I said, look, we need to help this individual out. Let me tell you what's not normal about this. Yep. No grown man is calling another grown man with that story. Sure. Unless sure. they trust him. Yep.